Starting today, the Jacksonville Transportation Authority, JTA, is adjusting some bus routes in response to a jump in demand for service. So since the coronavirus pandemic started, JTA officials have adjusted several times and frequencies in an effort uh, to keep drivers and customers safe. News for Jacks reporter Zach Lajway is joining us now live this morning with a closer look at which routes will be impacted by today's changes. Zach, good morning. Go. Good morning, Jen, and good morning to you at home. This morning, riders can expect to see a few changes, an increase in trips, and how often buses run along specific routes. Here's a look at routes that will be affected. Route 1, North Main. Route 3, Moncrief. Riders can expect to see additional PM trips. Route 10, Atlantic. Route 19, Arlington. Additional AM and PM trips. Route 50, University and the First Coast Flyer Red Line. This progression comes as the city continues its reopening plan. JTA says additional buses will continue to add frequency to routes as needed throughout the day as demand grows. One thing that's not changing, riders will notice some seats will remain blocked off to promote safe social distancing. All JTA employees are required to wear masks or face coverings while on the job. Social distancing, enhanced cleaning will remain in place at all JTA hubs. And while it is not mandated at this time, JTA is echoing the DOH's advisory, and that is for folks to wear masks or face coverings when they are in public, when they cannot safely social distance. Now, I do have a face mask on me. The reason why I'm not wearing it right now is because nobody's around. I have this space all to myself. My photographer and I are at a safe social distance. But to give you perspective on where we are, we are at Lot J this morning. That opens at nine o'clock, so we are less than an hour away from this testing site opening. Already this morning, people have been stopping by asking where the entrance is. If you are heading down to Lot J today, you will want to know the entrance is located on Gator Bowl Boulevard. We are currently at Georgia Street, so we're about a block away. This is a massive area, but Lot J will open at nine o'clock this morning. Reporting live, I'm Zach Lajway, Channel 4, The Local Station.